I'm here with Exclusive. She just finished the cycle. How do you feel you did in the cycle? Great. So how do you feel she did, Babs? I feel Exclusive was dope. For those who don't know, exclusive of my homie, I've been checking out, checking out her work since she came in the game. You know, I first seen her on World Star Hip Hop doing her thing, and I hit her up and I let her know that I respect her grind because I'm all about unities with the females. And when I hear a hot female, I like to hit them up and let them know, yo, you dope, keep pushing and make it happen. So you did your thing as always. You already know how I feel about you. Well, you know, I always got to do my self-promotion. Um, yeah, this is, well, I got five mixtapes out, actually, but this is my latest mixtape. Triple X, I'm um, hosted by DJ Jazzy Joyce, so that's out. Um, wait, wait, because this is really exclusive, so. If you All right, so this is the poster, the very exclusive poster, right? And, like, and if these, if y'all going to get this poster, right, they got to hit me up, right? If you want to purchase this poster, all right? If you want to purchase this poster, fellas, you know, if you want to do things to this poster, fellas, then you already know it's a slight fee, but you know, you can get it. Hang it up on your closet door in your bathroom, next to your bed, whatever. It's, it's exclusive, an exclusive place. My Twitter, um, twitter.com um, backslash very exclusive. So that's V-E-R-Y-X-C-L-U-S-I-V-E. -E. Um, YouTube.com slash very exclusive TV. So all the links that y'all got right there, you know, hit me up. If y'all, like I said, if y'all want to purchase a poster. And also, all my mixtapes is on datpiff.com. So, that's it. How do you feel you did in the cycle? I think I did good. I think I held my own, definitely, for the Bronx. Uh, I'm just thankful that I could be a part of this. Uh, this is a great, great opportunity. And I think that us four ladies held it down, represented for the Bronx. And, you know, I did my thing. I know I did good. What's up? <laughs> Scream at me. <laughs> I felt it was dope. I felt you did your thing, repping for the ladies, all the sexy ladies. She did her thing for the sexy ladies repping. And it's all about unity, you know. Don't hate, congratulate, and that's what I do. So I'm here to congratulate you on your, your, your hot rhyme that you spit tonight. That's what it is. And hard work pays off, so keep it up. That's what's up. What's new with you? What would you like to tell the world? Uh, basically, I'm just working hard, grinding, um, working on building a brand, building a name for myself. Five songs shy away from the EP. I'm also doing a uh, mixed CD, a mixed, um, excuse me, a mixtape with Young Billy D from Different Dreamers. That's going to be dope. Kind of an R. Kelly and J kind of feel, but you know, a guy singer and a female rapper is going to be dope. Look out for that. Also, you can follow me on Twitter at B A I G E Marie one zero, and check me out on Facebook, MySpace, Beige Marie ten. I'm just working hard, and we gonna do it, ladies. We almost here. Let's go. I'm here with Miss Emma Frost. She just finished the cycle. How yep. you feel you did? Of course I did. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the finishing touch. I'm Miss Icing on the Cake, where that came from. I feel Emma is dope. First of all, I, the first time I heard about Emma Ross was through my friend Lady Luck. Um, I was chilling with Lady Luck and she was like, yo, Babs, you gotta hear this girl. Yo, I don't even remember her name, but all I know she fire. Like, and then finally I hooked up with her. She came out, showed me love for my video. And yeah, and BK all day. So Emma, you know you dope, you know. It, I didn't even have to hear her at first because once Luck said she was dope, cause Luck don't like nobody. But once Luck said she was dope, I was like, oh, this, this girl gotta be dope. Yeah. So yeah, you, I feel she did her thing. Yes. It's funny cause you know, I'm just giving a little background on me. Like, I was doing my dancing shit, um, hip hop choreo, working with different artists. I danced for Max B. I was working with Pat Poos. I did mad shit. Then I um, start working with people that start pushing me to do this rapping shit. And this rapping shit is something I could do. And I'm bad with it. And I know I'm what it is. And it's a matter of time for, you know, big things just start popping. So, you know, we just doing what we got to do every day. And it doesn't stop. Emma Frost. <laughs> Emma Frost with two S's and no T's. <laughs> so how can they contact you? Where um, you be at? <laughs> well, y'all could come find me on, you know, Twitter. Y'all could follow me. And that's um Miss Emma Frost. M-S-E-M-M-A-F-R-O-S-S. -S. 
for Thanksgiving, November, I'm dropping my first project. It's called Icing on a Cake, because I'm the finishing touch. And um, this is my first project. So, you know, this, huh, right there, she um, posted, well, um, she's supposed to drop something for me, but we don't know yet. Like, we gonna see. We gonna see, like. I got you, I got you. We gonna see. Lady Luck, you too, you supposed to, you supposed to holler at me. What's good, all right. <laughs> I'm here with Belle now. She just also finished the cycle. How do you feel you did in the cycle? I think I did. I was a little nervous, but I think I did good. I did the best of my ability. That's all you could do. So, Babs, how do you feel like she did? I feel like you did really good. Cut the nervousness out. You know what I'm saying? You want to get in the game. This is this is lightweight right here. These people right here. You got to cut the nervousness out. You did good. You look good. And that's all that matters. You know, no reason to be nervous. So what you got going on for yourself? You got any mixtapes? You working on any albums? You know my mixtape right now. Four more songs and I'll be done. Bow the beast. Look for it. It'll be out soon. All right. So let them know how the, how the people could reach you. Twitter, Facebook, MySpace. Bar for Bar Bell. B A R the number four. B A R B E L L E. Bar for Bar Bell. Facebook. Um, I don't really do the Facebook thing. You a Twitter girl? <laughs> That, that mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So y'all can hit her up on Twitter at Bar for Bar Bell. Bar for Bar Bell. BX is in the building. Shout out to Bell for doing her thing, and that's what it is. Um, before we, before I end this, I want to give a big rest in peace to my nigga Huddy. Yo, we miss you. We love you. It's always love. Definitely. Make sure y'all hit me up um, on Twitter at Brooklyn Babs, and it's B A B S, not B A P S. But some people think it's Babs. No, it's Babs. Babs Bunny. Get it correct. Um, hit me up on Facebook, um, Babs Bunny. Hit me up on MySpace, First Lady Babs Bunny. Um, and like I said, if you can't remember that, just Google Babs Bunny, and all of that shit pops right on up. So, you know, right now, I'm on the, the female wave right now, representing for the females that spit. Don't get it twisted, because it's a lot of whack chicks out that rhyme, but they are really whack. So I'm not even trying to say I'm repping for all the female rappers. I'm repping for the hot female rappers. That's what I'm doing. And all the ladies that's trying to get in where they fit in, like... This one right here on the right of me, she's a model. She's a beautiful black woman trying to get in where she fit in. So we got to support each other and get it popping. Shout out to Boom for making it happen, you know, putting all the females together so we could do our thing because we need the checks just like the guys need the checks. We are the ones raising the kids. Why we can't get the checks? They're getting the checks, spending it all on jewelry. No. We tired of getting EBT cards. We want to pay for our food. Do we? No, no, we don't. But yeah, that's what it is. <laughs>